I I don't know what I'm going through right now. I like look at my hands. I don't know if it's a in the midst of anxiety or panic attack. I'm trying to be here. I got these silicone uh, ice cube trays. For the most part, they're pretty nice, easy to come out. I was really wor I was worrying a, a lot about if I'd get something from these silicone ice cube trays. They're just like any other tray, which is really good because they're good for stacking. And they're like the perfect ice cube. But I don't know if I'm getting tremors or whatever, but my nerves have been kind of missing a little bit. So I just gotta, I'm just going to sit down. So I'm not sure if I'm going through... Uh, just the thought process of uh, anxiety or what have you and I don't really want to talk to people about this because uh, people might call me a thought attack so I just want to yeah I don't know if I'm having tremors if it's like MLS or if it's like Parkinson's, early Parkinson's disease, I hope. I always think the worst, right? I always think the worst. So I'm just gonna take this. Got my gaming chair. That's uh, That's been making me really happy. Uh, sort of my early birthday present. My birthday's on Wednesday, July 22nd. Um, it's pretty nice, pretty nice. It would have came here a week ago, but it got delivered to my old address, and I was on call for like a week and a bit to Wayfair. I mean, yeah, these can be really expensive, but I got mine for 268 That was 70% sale off, and yeah, black and white. Pretty futuristic. And um, I had to watch a video on, on this. I'll have to get this out of here. I might have to do it as I'm sitting down on it. So if you're sitting down on it, you can push this. It's not that hard. So like this, and then just pull it out. Flip it, and then there you go. And you got your, and you got your foot stand. Wait, you need it. Yeah. There we go. It's been pretty hot. It's been pretty hot in here lately. Yeah. It's nice. Comfortable. Built for comfort. Built for my game and when I when I play some video games, my TV is 43 inch. Why did I put my water over there? Yeah, but I'm, I'm trying to manage, you know? I'm trying to remain safe from everybody. I don't know if these silicone things give it a different flavor or what. They're BPA free too. I'm just, I was just getting some kind of uh, chills and feel like I'm in, in an error. I feel like I'm an error. I feel like I'm just, uh, there's a bit of a paranoia feel to it. Um, I just had a, sh I just had a shower too, and I'm gonna try and make some food for myself. I'm a bit shaky. And my birthday is pretty soon. When I upload this, it'll probably be Sunday morning. Early Sunday morning, because it be like midnight, or past midnight, or later. Um, 
yeah, I'm just very shaky. And I haven't been I haven't been doing much. I haven't been really physically active. I I went to a beach. Or not to a beach. Yeah, I went to th no, sorry, Theus Lake. Um So I went to a lake last week and biked probably about six kilometers away. It was like stuff on my head forehead and people say, Oh, it's acne. Does not look like acne to me. Acne doesn't look like that. Uh, I don't know. Are we just told to keep everything inside internally and not tell anybody? <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to make some pierogies. I might not make any smokies because, well, I could make some smokies. Just a lot of work. I get money on, on Wednesday on my birthday and I'm going to kind of reward myself a little bit more. Get some skip the dishes. Get some Chinese food. I really like some Chinese food. Love Chinese food. I haven't had it in a while. Yeah, yeah, this is just me here just um, telling my subscribers 174 of you, sometimes less, sometimes more. In a span of almost 12 years, it's a lot. Like maybe after my birthday, I'm gonna kind of retire this channel. I think that's for the best. 20, 25 years. I've been doing this since I was 13, but then my first video was when I was 14. Uh, I I get escape my mind for a bit and put on The Dark Knight Rises, or even Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, Infinity War and Endgame, but that stuff's, you know, sad. I like Guardians. Um, there's a lot of messages behind Batman. Those Batman movies. I actually got, yesterday, as well as the... As well as the, uh... as well as the um, gaming chair um, wherever it is I actually got um, oh, where is it? I had it here a second ago I just had it here just not that long ago I just had it huh Hold on. Okay, so I got this Superman beanie. I'm not big of a Superman fan, but there are some parts of, of him that I do like. Tragic does the right thing, he's an immigrant, and is told not to use his powers to full extent or other, otherwise he'll, you know, hurt somebody or kill somebody with his powers. But it's hard to relate to Superman, and I felt like it was in time for a Superman beanie. It's really nice. I, there was a side by side for the same price, forty-three dollars. Superman and Batman. Be the Batman beanie was a hush beanie, and it had a different emblem as my other Batman beanie that you've seen in other videos. I was like, mm, I like the Superman beanie. It's like Superman's dead beanie with the black and white silver color color. I used to like Superman, but I've always liked Batman and Spider-Man and Wolverine above Superman. Um, but it's a, it's a nice beanie. It's a nice beanie. It's made by, it's made by New Era. Man of Steel album, so. gaming chair. I never climbed to what goes up. What goes up. 
little too high for me. That's for clients as well. And then they have the lumbar thing. So then you can do it like this. Push it out. Uh, leather pleather uh, armrests, nice. And then these can be taken off the pillow up here and the lumbar down here. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. Beats, beats sitting down on my on my futon. So we have seventy percent off here. Pretty good deal. I don't know um, what I'm going through. Cardiac arrest, maybe. Who knows? I plan on doing. Um, a special song for a special someone who took his life three years ago. His name's Chester Bennington. I never met him. Uh, he was a singer at Lincoln Park. And um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to play it and sing it at the same time just because of my nerves lately. I think I just might uh, karaoke it. I think I'll probably be doing what I've done because that song goes back to when I watched Transformers and when I had the, C the minute, Minutes the Midnight CD from Linkin Park. Uh, probably one of my favorite albums by them, or my favorite album of all time, actually, is Minutes the Midnight. Um, so I don't know how to do it because I'll be doing it on the anniversary of when he passed away three years ago, when he took his own life, and that will be on Monday, two days before my birthday, July 20th. I'm, I'm in a, not haze, but it's like I'm in a, I'm in a, weird obstacle, right? So, I don't know what to do. I just wanted to kind of make this video, and yeah. Um, not as shaky as I was, I'm still shaky. And it turns out I have arthritis too. Uh, my jaw is a sign of arthritis. Anybody can get arthritis at any age. So I'm going to try and figure that out. And uh, a little bit after my birthday I'm going to get myself to the dentist or call some call somebody who actually cares and uh, yeah I gotta get some food in me right now. But for a while I'm gonna take some time off for for a little bit, maybe maybe a week or two. We'll see, right? I need to take some time off, but sometimes this helps me escape a little bit. I don't know what it is. I always think the worst. Am I am I getting am I going crazy? Is anybody gonna save me? Just like. Simple plan song, crazy, right? So. I need to turn on a movie or something and get some food and watch, eat some food and watch a movie. I tried watching Onward many times for the last month or two. And 
watched half of it the other day, so I haven't finished it yet. Um, yeah. I don't know, it's like weird chills and equilibrium's off or just something. I need to, I need to really talk, I need to really take a break for a, a week or two, try and exercise, try and figure stuff out. I'm just like, just almost par paralyzed, petrified. And um, I just thought I'd share this to you guys. I've had a hard go this last 25 years. Uh, we'll see. Maybe I'll, 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 I'll do, uh, this depends how I feel, I'll do some videos. Maybe on my birthday, I know I'm gonna, I knew I was gonna spend my birthday alone and uh, be isolated. But it's, it's kind of how it is, I guess. In some ways I like it, in some ways I don't. And this time I just, I don't know who to talk to because if you want to try to talk to someone you'll just, you'll get, you'll get hurt for it for now. I don't know why. But, yeah. I made my first iced coffee today. I'm just drinking water. Just had one piece of coffee today. It was like, oof. That was quite a bit of coffee. Some ice cold water. I've been watching all the the bat the uh, Batman from uh, the Dark Knight trilogy that Christopher Nolan directed. So I have the Dark Knight Rises to watch again. I, I'm just watching stuff I've seen before and stuff I've loved and rewatching it. Just kind of going through that. It, it's harder for me to kind of watch new stuff, though I did watch. Slenderman many days ago. It was alright. <laughs> and I'm playing Fortnite again here and there now. Uh, I just need a longer cord for my PlayStation. There's a saying there's a saying that this too shall pass, and I hopefully it does. Uh, every time you feel like dying, keep climbing the mountain. It's a really tough mountain to climb. And Three Days Grace says that in their song, The Mountain. And another song they have called The End Is Not The Answer. Very short, quick song, but it's like under under three minutes. It's like two and a, two and a half minutes, maybe, maybe two and a quarter. And it goes, the end is not the answer. You and, you and I are in this together. Don't you give up ever, because the end is not the answer. I know it's very generic and very like, hmm. I mean, there's a sign of hope in there, and it's kind of, you know, cliche to say, enforced and whatever have you, but, you know, I love Three Days Grace. They're my favorite band, and, uh, yeah. So hopefully this gets an edit and I can upload it and yeah. But it may not seem like it. I mean, I have bags under my eyes. I I feel these things that people can't even fathom and that I can't even understand. So uh, yeah, maybe it's just that. It, Thing to try and talk to someone like counseling or something. I've, I've gone through a lot in the last 25 years. Definitely in the last 10 years. Uh, I'm still me, but I'm also a, not me. I also I feel I don't feel like the same me 10 years ago. Yeah. In another year, it will have been. 10 years next year that I formed my first band and I think 
I think within like two or three years I had to kind of say goodbye to that group because we were basically a poster band and asking for people. And it was tough. It was really tough. And none of, them, none of my members, band members, bandmates talked to me anymore. It was t it's tough. It's tough. It's like, it's like the song Lincoln Park. It's like I've become so numb I can't feel you there. I'm so tired, so much more aware. I'm, I'm becoming this. All I want to do is to be more like me and to be less like you. And I wanted to be less, less of like my drummer, who was my co like the co-founder of my band. He was just, you know, very big on religion and uh, playing strictly worship uh, Christian music and I was influenced at a time by this band called Petra and uh, yeah it kind of hurt me and to know when I got in contact with the band Petra that they were really not for you know LGBT and not really the nicest energy out there I mean, I can talk about that for a while. And I'm handling, I'm harnessing in my stuff all the time, but it's like, it's like Jekyll and Hyde, right? Light and day, the other, so. Yeah. I think I'm paranoid and complicated. It's a little song from Garbage. I think I'm paranoid. I think, I know. I need to start doing some sit-ups and stuff because if I don't, I'm going to be getting fat. But I, need, I need to sort out stuff now. Like I thought of maybe get my ears pierced. Maybe I can get my ears pierced down the road. But I need to figure out stuff for my jaw. And uh, just take some time off. I always take some time. I always have time. All the time in the world to stare at four walls and take time for myself. But now I really gotta just take a break for a bit. I think a little bit after my birthday I will take I will take a break for for a week or two and then just figure out where my head is at and then see what I'll be doing for this channel here on out. Might be drinking on my birthday, might get, get some drinks for my birthday. On my grocery list I'm getting a cake for my birthday so it's pretty cool. Turn 25, I'm still here. I've outlived some of my friends. Yeah, I'm still here. And hopefully you are here to celebrate me and me being on here for nearly 12 years. So hopefully this was worth listening to. And I'm going to try and figure out what the hell the fuck is wrong with me. I know a lot of this stuff is hereditary and some of it has been bestowed upon me and stuff I've had to endure. But yeah, I can't believe I'm here still. Quarter Life Crisis, now officially. Maybe I'll do that song too by Judah and the Lion, I think it was. So, yeah. It's not easy to be me. Superman song by Fight for Fighting. Okay, guys, I, I'm gonna hop off here. I'm gonna get some food, make some food, watch Batman, and then go to bed. The Dark Knight Rises. Try and try and ease my mind and meditate and collect collect my thoughts and figure things out. 
I'll be posting some videos this week. Maybe a couple of music videos we'll see and stuff for my birthday on my birthday. Okay guys, hopefully this was worth listening to. Hope you like my beanie, my chair. And yeah, it's nice. It's really nice. See you guys.